T. Harv Eker, an American author, businessman, and motivational speaker once said, rich people are committed to being rich. Poor people want to be rich. To become wealthy or a millionaire, you need to understand that it is all about consistently the right habits. If you want to become a millionaire, then you have to work for it, because no one will wake up one morning and decide to give you a million dollars, except you have worked for it. Every millionaire understands the words of the American entrepreneur and author Jim Rohn, that if you don't design your life plan, chances are you'll fall into someone else's plan. And guess what they have planned for you? Not much. Designing your life means developing yourself, which involves learning, growing, and developing specific skills that are peculiar to millionaires. In this video, I'll share with you 10 skills every future millionaire must have. If you're new here, consider subscribing so you won't miss other exciting videos like this. Number 1. How to become a master in your field According to Chef Jiro, a Japanese chef and owner of Shukiabashi Jiro, you must immerse yourself in your work. You have to fall in love with your work. You must dedicate your life to mastering your skill. That's the secret of success. If you want to become successful and a millionaire, you have to show to the world that as far as your field is concerned, you are the go-to person. When people perceive you to be an expert in your area, they will be willing to pay you so much money to have you attend to their needs. The more problems you solve in that field, the more potential customers or clients you get, the more your network increases and the more money you earn. It's that simple. Tim Robbins said, most people have no idea of the giant capacity we can immediately command when we focus all of our resources on mastering a single area of our lives. Number 2. How to sell Every millionaire knows that selling is a massive part of life and that everyone is either selling or buying. Millionaires, however, pick the side of sales because they know that the more they sell, the more money they make. Unfortunately, people consider selling manipulation rather than rationalized persuasion. However, millionaires understand that the key to selling is making people see the value of a product or service. To learn how to sell, you can either read books, take courses, or attend sales and branding seminars if you want to become a millionaire. Number 3. How to market Marketing, unlike sales, has to do with the buyers. Here's the thing. Selling deals with the need of the seller, while marketing deals with the need for the buyers. How, though? When you create an incredible product, your aim as the producer is to make money from selling your product, right? When you market something, on the other hand, your market is as a solution to a problem. So, while sales have to deal with making profit for the producer, marketing has to deal with satisfying customers. Hence the need to know how to market. Number 4. How to network According to award-winning entrepreneur and keynote speaker Susan Solovic, people do business with people they know, like and trust. How do you get more people to know and trust you? Simple networking. Robert T. Kiyosaki once said that the richest people in the world look for and build networks. Everyone else looks for work. Marinate on that for a minute. Networking is giving people a chance to see how valuable you can be to them. It's showing people that they can trust you and trust you to meet their needs as far as your field is concerned. It's not about what you can get from people, but what you can do for them. Christine Lynch said, Networking is marketing. Marketing yourself, your uniqueness, what you stand for. Number 5. Emotional Intelligence Knowing human nature is the key to success. 
Emotional intelligence is the key to improving your effectiveness. And being emotionally intelligent means that you have to understand motivation, body language, tone of voice, tact, diplomacy, empathy and everything related to emotional intelligence to effectively communicate and network with others. Joshua Friedman, a specialist on emotional intelligence, an author and the chief executive of Six Seconds said, Emotional intelligence is a way of recognizing, understanding and choosing how we think, feel and act. It shapes our interactions with others and our understanding of ourselves. It defines how and what we learn. It allows us to set priorities. It determines the majority of our daily actions. Research suggests it is responsible for as much as 80% of the success in our lives. Number 6. Self-development Millionaires keep learning because they know they cannot grow without learning. And if they don't grow, they won't make money anymore. So, instead of spending the whole day getting entertained on social media or the TV, they invest in themselves. They read books, take courses, attend classes, go for seminars and conferences to learn more about their field and other relevant subjects that can facilitate their growth. Brian Tracy said, Personal development is a major time saver. The better you become, the less time it takes you to achieve your goals. Number 7. How to manage money According to American author and entrepreneur T. Harv Ecker, the single biggest difference between financial success and financial failure is how well you manage your money. It's simple. To master money, you must manage money. Millionaires know how to manage money. That is why they remain millionaires for long. Guess what? They started managing money before they became millionaires. And that's why they were able to become one in the first place. As Ecker said, you have to learn how to master money to become a millionaire. Number 8. How to manage time Alan Lakin said, Time equals life. Therefore, waste your time and waste of your life. Or master your time and master your life. Time is valuable and millionaires know this. It is why they learn to manage their time effectively. They often start their day by setting goals and prioritizing each task for the day. However, this is not a habit they began when they became millionaires. Instead, their effective use of time led to their millionaire position. M. Scott Peck said, Until you value yourself, you will not value your time. Until you value your time, you will not do anything with it. Number 9. Self-discipline One might be tempted to think that millionaires are the least disciplined people because they have so much money that they can decide to lavish whenever they want. Sorry to burst your bubble, they are anything but indisciplined. Also, millionaires understand that it takes discipline to achieve their goals. It takes control to go to work when everyone else is having fun. It takes discipline to stay up late and wake up early because you have goals to accomplish within a stipulated time. According to Jim Rohn, discipline is the bridge between goals and accomplishments. Number 10. How to lead Every successful person is a leader in their field. They are people that influence and command authority in their respective fields. They understand that they must follow great leaders as they become one themselves. They know when to take responsibility and initiative when tough situations occur. Most importantly, they know how to inspire not only themselves but others as well, even when all hope is gone. Millionaires understand that leadership is a way of life, a way of thinking, not an opportunity to control and rule over people. 
Instead, it's an opportunity to help people solve their problems. Colin Powell once said that leadership is solving problems. The day soldiers stop bringing you their problems is the day you have stopped leading them. They have either lost confidence that you can help or conclude you do not care. Either case is a failure of leadership. Thank you very much for watching our videos. If you like this video, watch more videos on our channel and subscribe. We love you.